hello everyone out there this is a Volvo 2005 in this vehicle it's not wait to check the engine oil unless you check with the DST here but the, the stick is missing the metal stick is missing so you gotta change the whole part here I have the new one here this is the new one here on my hands it's universal this is the part this is the part number right so to start it we gotta lose take it out this little guy here this ball he's also got another ball on the bottom see I already have it out see that's the hose right there So, this is a D12 engine, D12, in a Volvo 2005. Okay, we already have it out. This is the old one, you see? This part here is going the bottom part. Okay. And this one here, this is the housing that go inside the engine engine band so this part this part here this part is going inside this hose here okay okay so let's get the new the new pipe and let's make a freeze okay and this is the new pipe here we are about to put it inside the housing see we make it in nice and make it go in the most you can you see into get lack see the yellow mark here the yellow mark that means it ready in it, all the way you know so now we're gonna put some grease here on the sear and we're going to put it inside the engine. We're going to put it into the into the pan. Okay, so far, so far we have it inside the engine pan. Some of those is going the engine block, you know, but in this case it's going the engine pan. This is the engine pan here. So you got a 12 millimeter ball here. I got it tiny a little bit more. You got a small range, 12 millimeter there. And you don't have to go that crazy to tighten them up. Just a little bit. That'd be good there. That, that feel like 25 pounds of torque so so far we're gonna go see on top and ready to put the that small very small ball here we go so this is how it look over here see now you gotta make a turn little turn push it down make a fist there see You don't have to worry, it's not gonna break, you see? So this is how it look. But we're gonna take the stick out to make it be more flexible. I would like to hold it on somewhere. Okay, this is how it look. It ready installed it there. So now we are going to check the oil level on the engine. In this tip here, let me see if you can see it there. Yeah, right there. You see why it say mass? 
mass. That's the maximum level you can add. Do not add over here. Okay, that's too much. So you gotta be in the mass session or between here, okay? Minimum, minimum mark, okay? So let's check what happened. If it's too over full, it's not good because it might blow some seal there. It might damage, may damage to another parts. But if it's too low, it's also not good because it, it can maybe cause damage in the engine. So we are here. Oh my God, this is so full. So this is no good. See, it's over the top mark. You see, it's supposed to be all the way down. You see where it say mass? So it's over the limit. That's a lot of oil. In that case, we're gonna have to take it out. More oil, at least four quarts. And you see guys, what is very important, this part here, because without this part, you cannot check the level of the oil in your engine. So remember, to keep your engine running in good shape and always do your maintenance. So I hope you enjoy the video. I hope you guys like the video. Thank you for watching.